we're live that's been stable for a couple of minutes uh hopefully you guys can see me for some reason <laughs> chat is disabled really oh everything's playing up so i've got no chat in <laughs> in stream labs because apparently it's disabled uh for this thing so i'm gonna pop out the normal chat and uh, and bring that across hopefully that will allow me to see things uh, let's all right, no, let's bring that across there, uh, and then across there, and then that's all good. And then I got my chat window in the normal place, which is nice and useful. Uh, have I got my chat window? Come on, no, no, no. Of course, this is this is where you kind of hope everything goes according to plan. Uh, there we go. That's working now. So I can see you. You can see me. It's all good. <laughs> Let's say hello to everybody in chat. So hello and welcome along to Transformer, Jordan Donahue, Matt Westlake, uh, Martin ML Gamer, J Turver, Jorgen, uh, Jorgen Anderson, uh, Zach MCG1, Landy Boy, Weird Flex, KJ MFS, Simulator Gaming, uh, Mafia X Phantom, Ponyon Zatsk. Uh, I have a G29, by the way. Uh, Mr. Farmer Sim, welcome along. Andre Wolf 03, welcome along. Aaron Foster, Jimmy Green, Bro Bernard, 2006, welcome along. Lewis Loves Rihanna, welcome along. Trevor Wig Wiggins, uh, Max Hardgreaves is live. The Crazy Ewok, uh, cool name, the Crazy Ewok. Uh, the FS Fab, Jimmy Green, and Jammy Pudding 83. JT, the Gamer Guys, Shane Kelly, Rowan Hawkins, uh, Fugen, um, welcome along. Uh, Scottish Farmer, welcome along. Uh, RC Gaming, welcome on Liam Spring, welcome on Mitch Mass. Um, oh wow, lots of people in here. Jake Bowles, welcome along. Uh, Jonathan Gobbin, welcome along. Tim F, welcome along. Lewis Miller, welcome along. Um, D Turnbull, welcome along. Uh, Farmer Dodd, welcome along. Zach Farmer, Jamie McGarren, uh, Top Farmer, welcome along. Emma Borgensen, welcome along. Kevin O'Brien, welcome along. Farmer Stuo5, welcome along. Uh, Will Sinclair, welcome along. Elite Farming, welcome along. Kane Loster, welcome along. Nathan, welcome along. Uh, Max Hargreaves, welcome along. Jesse's Log, welcome along. Big Man Jim and Jenny, the student nurse, welcome along. Uh, Brendan Agri Contracts, welcome along. Adabu814, welcome along. Uh, SJ Contracts, welcome along. JT the Gamer Guys, welcome along. Um, I think that's Joshua O'Reilly, welcome along. Uh, Martin, I think I've said hello to you, but hey Martin, ML Gamer, Sam Huxable, welcome along. Uh, I think that's everybody. Let's jump into Vultra T174. Tim Jury, welcome along. I think that's I'm gonna I'm gonna jump in now because otherwise this entire stream. Is just going to be me saying hello to everybody. Hello, Jack Barlow. Welcome along. Right. Let's... Uh, William Curie, welcome along. Let's go and have a look at what we've got to do today. Jumping into this. We have 92 people in here already. Uh, hit that like button. Let's see if we can get... We've got 102. Let's see if we can hit 
Um, uh, let's see if we can hit 100 likes and get happy darts fairly quickly today. Um, what do we have? So, we have plowed fields 87 and 79. We need to plow 78 and 77. The other thing we need to work out today is we do, it's snowing. We're going to have, well, this, it says rain, but this is snow. Um, we're going to have... We're going to need somewhere to put a, um, a something to store our grain. We need a, uh, yeah, we need a silo. And I'm not 100% sure where to put one. I think we're going to have to carve out a slight bit of this field, maybe, to put our silo in. Because the only other place I can... Hey, Liam Mapletoff! Um, is possibly in this area here where we've got this stuff. And we could po possibly put a new parking space for this kind of equipment elsewhere. So, uh, yeah, we've got to work that out. We're going to have to work that out a little bit later, I think. May even be that we just put a shed in. So, we need to do some plowing. So, that is going to be, uh, well, cultivate. Uh, we're going to use this for one thing. Because this is our subsoiler. So we're going to get this cultivating in one field. Hello, Matthew Pollard. Uh, which will be 78. There we go. Yeah, so this uh, stream will go on till about, uh, about quarter past uh, 10. Hey, Ortho and Gamer Dragon, welcome along. Yeah, it's, uh, I finally got my uh, internet to work. I basically had to reset my entire network. Hey, Terrier, welcome along. Uh, please, uh, please go check out both Gamer Dragon and Terrier, uh, both fantastic YouTubers, and in uh, GD's case, also a fantastic Twitch streamer. Uh, right, we want to uh, generate this course. We want field 78, current vehicle position, starting direction. Uh, I don't think we can match it to our... No, we can't match it. So we're going to go longest edge because that's always a good way to go, I think. Uh, bypass island, skip rows, multiple. Yeah, 2.8 meters. Headland. Uh, we want three, uh, four headlands we normally do. We want it to finish here. So that's counterclockwise. Uh, we want to do up, down rows first. We want it to turn in the corners. And we want it to generate our course. There we go. Oof. So, how is everybody on this Sunday night? Hey, Mazmus, welcome along. I hope everybody has had a good weekend. There we go. Yeah, and it's done exactly what I expected to, which is great. And finishing at this point here, which is even better. Now, this field, of course, is already cultivated. Um, we need it, but we need it to be ploughed as well to get the maximum out. It is only... It's only early spring now. This is the... S oh, no. This is this is the second stream. So, that's okay. That's okay. I've had a bit of weirdness on Marwa Manor where it's reset a day. So, uh, yeah. That's a bit weird. So, I think we're probably going to end up skipping the last day of spring on Marwa Manor. Uh, first waypoint. Drive course. And away we go. And you can see uh, where it's going new. So, that's all good. So we'll let that go. Oh, no, I can't do that. This is the realism experiment. I'm not allowed to do that. Yeah, okay. We need to put the parking stuff on here. So that is uh, control T. Because we're not allowed to tab. So we need to, on our new equipment, need to put control T on. Because, yeah, not allowed to tab. Naughty VF. Uh, yes, I massively recommend my G29. 130 watching, 70 likes. That's fantastic. Uh, and then we're going to get the cheetah plow up, but not before I work out what we're going to do. Right. So we know we've got this area here. Uh, this field does have this here. So I think we'll go into the landscaping tool. And you can see this field here has two bits. So we've got this large area up the top here, which I don't think we'll use. But down the side of the field here, we've got an area which we could we could conceivably pull across here and add just a little area here to put stuff. Now, we can either use that to um, 
put stuff uh, this stuff here or we can try and put a set of silos on so i'm going to see what we've got silo wise first so we want something a bit thin we're probably going to want something kind of like this uh, rather than anything bigger i think bigger silos well we don't really have any other silos I don't have enough money. Ha! We don't have enough money for silos. We're going to have to tip it in our barn for now. First year, I think. That is basically what that has said to us. We won't be able... We'll have to have a corner of the barn and either... Yeah, we need to save it and sell it later. Right. So that basically has put the kibosh on that. Let's head out and, uh, and get the cheaty plow, which is over this way. So yeah, our biggest problem is we don't have a silo. Looking forward to the stream. Awesome, Sam Travers. I'm glad you have been looking forward to this. Right, there we go. So uh, Terrier named this the Cheaty Plow. It's uh, it's basically a subsoil that acts like a plow. Uh, but it is a mod available on the Mod Hub. Uh, it's not something I've altered myself. So uh, yeah, we can use it. Uh, and to use it, we're going to have to work out the best point on this field. Yeah, I think we're going to end up using that bit of field. But uh, first season, we were, uh, first, yeah, first year, we won't. We can add a little bit of field to this field, though. Looking at this. Right, so do we have create fields on? We don't. So let's allow create fields. Down we go with it. And away we go with it. There we go. Uh, is this map coming to console? Yes, I believe it is. Oh, we need to get some fuel in this tractor in a minute as well. Terrier, Terrier does have a cheaty plow addiction. So we're not quite traveling straight across the map here it's still a little bit cold to really get any crops in the ground you're flying out of london tomorrow first thing awesome i'm good thank you paul yeah i'm doing well uh when will it be on console uh once green bale has finished it because that's the thing at the moment it's uh it's not on console uh but he has said he is going to do it. Right, so that is basically where we want that. Uh, thank you for subscribing, Isaac. Welcome to the BFN. Does Greenwich have multi-terrain angle? Um, not by the looks of it, in all honesty. Looking at that. Hopefully that's a good position. Yep, that is. Um, but it might have. Oh, no, I think it does, actually, because we're doing a weird angle on field 78, so it must have. I uh, think I should do the realism. I do it twice a week. We do it on a Wednesday and on a Sunday. Let's try to do <laughs> hello, 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 NEX. Welcome along. Uh, hello, Caleb Matic. Welcome along. So, yeah, we should get our fields finished today. Uh, I need to check on the status of our pigs, but they should be all right. Oh, we might have to reset our... Because um, the animal uh, mod uh, uh, has an uh, animal extension updated. So, uh, I may have to reset my stuff on that today as well. Good budget wheels. Um, well, this, this wheel and this shifter, actually, I've seen for as little as £150. Uh, which, at these days, that is a massively budget wheel. So we are going to have to do a headland on this end. But otherwise, we should be alright, I think, on the other end. Second hand G29. I, I'm always wary of second hand wheels, uh, if I'm honest. They always seem to be a little bit... Um, yeah, you, you never quite know what you're getting. Hydrogen 70 watching. 20, I oh know, 15 minutes in. 
I uh, wouldn't get second hand, but yeah, that's the thing. You don't know how long the person's been using it, how heavily they've been using it. Um, I wouldn't recommend a second hand wing. I would recommend Black Friday is coming up and keeping an eye out because there will be a great deal for that. Hey, Matt, welcome along. And Matt Westlake. Oh, <laughs> no, Matt Westlake is a Sprooks. Uh, so that's awesome. Hey, Matt. <laughs> Four to a happy dance. Oh, it's a little bumpy at the top end of this field. That is going to be fun with a combine header. Yeah, there's a very nice big bump here. That is going to be great fun with the combine header. <clears throat> Your old G27 in bits, refurbed, and re-squeezed everything with plus. Nice. 96 likes, 171 watching. If everybody hit that like button now, it would be instant song. But it's considering how many people we drove off last time with the song, may not be such a great idea. <laughs> Hello, Mark. Welcome along. 100 likes! We have 100 likes. Oh, I might just uh, do this back bottom edge, actually, quickly. It's because I'm not 100% sure where I should be going, so... Yeah, we'll get this bottom edge done. First, though, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You're awesome, you're awesome, you're awesome, you're awesome. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You're awesome, you're awesome, you're awesome, you're awesome. Ah. 118 likes. Wow, we are, we are swiftly heading towards that song, aren't we? There's a Ford 78 Ted mod on Mod Hoster. I will have to go and check that out. Because I love my 78 Tens. Hello, Kurt TV. Thank you, uh, Gamer Grimsy. Wait till you hear the song. 122. <laughs> uh, rarely do people go, oh, awesome song, beer. Take this up to here. Yep. Yeah, doing the headland first. Not the most realistic. And that is also not straight. Right, let's see if we can actually get this straight. Because otherwise that is going to come back to haunt me. Curve that in there. Let's keep that straighter than that. I love my dancing scene. Thank you, Aaron Foster. Hey, Oxy, welcome along. Awesome work on Shamrock Valley, by the way, Oxy. Fantastic map. If you guys haven't checked out my first look at Oxy's, um, Oxy's awesome Shamrock Valley, go check it out after the stream. Um, yeah, absolutely brilliant map that, and I cannot wait to get Eddie restarted. He's gonna have, uh, he's gonna have done a little bit of work to his farm. There we go. Right, and we now can actually do this a little bit straighter as well. Which will make things easier on us. Greetings, map god. <laughs> there we go. Ah, oh, brilliant. Thank you, Oxy. Yeah, because I need to, as, as I discussed with you, I need to... <laughs> this is the thing. First thing I said to Oxy when he sent me the map was, Is it okay if I edit it? Ah. <laughs> uh. Because, yeah, I need to set up Eddie's farm as it was in uh, in FS17. So. Uh. Dude, I might have to burn the barred roof again. Doors are awesome, Oxy. Fantastic.
Yeah, so we're going to be, well, as a result of that, we're actually going to be running two role plays on the channel. Uh, which will be different, because I've not run two role plays at once before. I believe Shamrock is going to Giants this week for testing. Right, that straightened things out. Will it be see? Yes. Yeah, I couldn't do a role play on if it wasn't season compatible. There we go. Thank you for following Freak Hello Hello uh, underscore R J R B. Welcome to the BFN. For those who want to follow, is it's Twitch. So, uh, yeah, if you want to follow me on Twitch, where I also stream three times a week, uh, please pop over there and hit that follow button. It is twitch.tv forward slash virtual farmer. Uh, still need voice actors. I am considering it, Martin. Um, yeah, I, I, I want to try and work. I want to get um, certainly uh, growers we're going to get established and um, Shamrock will get established. And then I might be after some voice actors. For some small parts. But it's going to take more planning from me. Uh, in order to get that kind of stuff done. Thank you for subscribing. Dope Meister. Welcome to the BFN. Can't wait for Shamrock. Yeah. It's, Shamrock is awesome. It really is awesome. Can't voice over as no mate. Ah. Um, yeah, the people I will be approaching first. Uh, will be uh, patrons. Um, especially anybody at producer level. Um, because, uh, yeah, that's what you guys signed up for. <laughs> we do need to go and fill this tractor up in a minute. I think our other tractor ran out of fuel last time. Thank you for the follow, Lewis Miller One. Welcome to the BFN. Sussex Farm is looking nice as well. Uh, uh, Alien Jim does some fantastic work. Awesome. Oh, nice. Absolutely fantastic, Oxy. Oh, yeah, Carlson as well. Looking forward to that map. As far as just like vloggers and modders like the FNOX, you make this game so much. Ah, oh, thank you very much, Lannister Farms. Hey, MJ Modding, welcome along. Uh, I saw that KJMFS. As I said, once I've worked out what I'm going to do, uh, I will be um, hitting up those in my Patreon channels. Ireland, and it feels like Ireland. It really does. It's one of the things I love about Shamrock is it, it massively feels like an Irish map. Some, sometimes you drive around an Irish map and it feels English, which is not good. Or you drive around a Scottish map and it feels English, which is also not good. But, uh, yeah, both MJ and Oxy have made maps that feel like where they should be. Uh, depends on how quickly it passes, uh, C. Stewart. Hundred and ninety two hundred watching. Woo! Thank you for following Revo seventy eight ninety six. Welcome to the BFM. Enter the stream, rules I heard us. We have I have to burn the barn roof again. <laughs> That's cause Eddie's coming back and he has a burnt uh, he has a burnt bale shed. If anybody uh, remembers the uh, episode from FS17, where uh, Eddie's uh, bale shed went up in flames. Must be getting to close to season, must be. Um, my information suggests seasons for console around about Christmas. Uh, I certainly wouldn't expect it before then. The VFN. Oh, <laughs> no, no. Gaming channel. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the BFN. 
I thought that was the VFN gaming channel for a moment and I went, whoa. This Ford is beautiful. I, I love the two Fords we got on here. So this is the 7840. Uh, we got the 8340 doing the job in the other field, just the other side of the hedge there. So we'll have, um, yeah, we'll have our fields prepared plow-wise today. Um, what we should do and what we need to do is um, we need to get some lime on here, I think. Now, we only have 36,000 left. So I think we may have to rent a lime, um, a lime spreader. Now, we're also going to have to get some lime for it, which is going to be costly. Run for these forts on every map you play. I'm looking forward. I'm, I'm looking for some older ones as well. Uh, apparently, yeah, there's a 7810. So if there is, we may end up getting that on here as well. Ah. You remember the last realism experiment stream? We've been doing these since FS17. Our first realism experiment was on um, Cobra Park Farm. And, uh, and that was a monster one. That went really well. We did like 70 streams on that. And it was just absolutely awesome. If you ever get the chance, uh, go back and watch that. Because that is, that is where all the groundwork for this series was laid. Um, we then, of course, have also done the realism experiment on Oakfield Farm. Uh, which is where we switched from last stream. Uh, after doing a year on there. And we've actually, uh, we're actually doing a little bit better on here. We've got four fields straight off. Um, which we didn't have last time. We should have crops in in time, which we didn't do last time. Uh, we should, yeah, we should be in a better position starting this time, uh, which is good. Uh, and these tractors, if you're wondering why I've got 11 hours on this tractor when we've only done one stream on here, these tractors came over from Oakfield Farm as well. But we did do a slight reconfiguration of some of our equipment. So the JCB telehandler went last time. Um, we've replaced that with a uh, the class front loader and uh, and a couple of bits. What's the burnt bark roof? You think so? Shamrock Valley. When we do it, we are continuing from a role play we did in FS17 uh, with a character called Eddie. Um, about 14 episodes into the series, Eddie's barn, uh, Eddie's straw barn went up in flames. Uh, it took a um, it took a baler and a potato harvester with it, um, and uh, and yeah. So there's a uh, you'll you'll see the thumbnail on my channel. It is just the barn in complete flames. Now the fire got put out. The barn was still uh, safe, um, but it does have an awful lot of um, scorch marks on it. So we need to I need to edit the map and put the scorch marks back on the barn. The uh, one slight Easter egg in is in that in, is that because it uses the same texture as the barn up at the main farm, uh, the main farm barn ends up with a uh, with scorch marks on it as well. Um, I would love Ballincraig Estate to come up out for FS19. However, if it did, I would have to do a monumental edit on it before Eddie could go back on there. Um, because the version of Ballincraig I ended up with massively different to the version of Ballincraig uh, that was released. I edited the hell out of that map. Six more likes till your phone rings. <laughs> and I have to sing songs while plowing. So I'm not going to stop and uh, sing today. I will uh, I will just sing while I plow. Because that makes more sense. <laughs> and scares less, uh, and scares fewer people off. 225 watching at the moment. We are 30 minutes in. I need to press a button. Right. And onward. Hey, Simulation for the Nation. Welcome along. Hello, Jonathan Mortimer. Welcome along. Thomas Smith. Welcome along. Ah, Gav8080. Welcome along. Go and check out Gav8080's channel. Uh, he's a fantastic YouTuber. Fellow uh, Norfolk. 
Um, a ne fellow Norfolk person like Gamer Dragon. And also has farmed my dad's farm. Uh, later, Terrier. As I said before, go check out Terrier too. 154 likes. Have. <laughs> right, is that why Terrier's going to go? This is when half my moderators disappear. <laughs> uh, I am waiting for confirmation that we will be singing. And I apologize in advance. Hello, Benny uh, B41. Been here since Sun. Have I? I've even. Oh, sorry. I, I get lost in this. Not at all. Uh, not all. 164 likes, apparently. I'd better get some music up before I start this. And by music, I mean lyrics. Um, right. There we go. Wurzel's World. Pause the music. Why am I always playing Ruby when I do this? <coughs> I drove me a tracker through your race that last night. Who are you? I threw me a pitchfork at your dog to keep quiet. Who are you? Now something's telling me that you've been avoiding me. Who are you? Come on now, darling. I've got something you need. Cause I've got a brand new car by the harvester and I'll give you the key. Come on now, let's get together in perfect harmony. I've got 20 acres and you've got 43. Now I've got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Oh, she made me laugh. Ah. I'll stick by you. I'll give you all that you need. You are, you are. We'll have twins and triplets. I'm a man built for speed. You are, you are. And you know I'll love you, darling. So give me your hand. You are, you are. But what I want most is all those acres of land. Cause I've got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Come on now, let's get together in perfect harmony. I've got 20 acres and you've got 43. Now I've got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Ooh, she's a lovely bit of stuff and all. For seven long years I've been alone in this place. Who are you? Are you sleep in the kitchen? It's a proper disgrace. Who are you? Are? Now if, he, if I cleaned it up. Would you change your mind? Who are you? I'll give up drinking scrumpy and that lager and lime. Cause I've got a brand new call by harvester and I'll give you the key. Come on now, let's get together in perfect harmony. I've got 20 acres and you've got 43. Now I got a brand new cup harvester and I'll give you the key. Weren't we a grand couple at that last Wurzel's dance? I want my brand new gaiters and me corduroy pants. In your new Sunday dress with your perfume smelling grand. We had our photos took of us sold in hands. Cause I got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Come on now let's, now that we're part of 50s I think that you and me should stop this gallivanting and will you marry me? Cause I've got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. There we go, everybody. That is your reward for 150 likes. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I've got a brand new combine harvester. How do I kneel to the unit? Because I'm almost there. I'm so close. But as you heard, in the last verse, I still mucked it up. <laughs> Thank you, uh, C. Stewart. And we've gone up. We went up in viewers. We went up in viewers. <laughs> Did I join it? Hey, Liam. <laughs> He's improving, but you'd be lying. <laughs> uh, this is PC, Sean. Uh, uh, Greenwich Valley is not yet released on console. View count has actually increased. We've got nearly 250 people in here. That is absolutely awesome. Thank you, everybody who has joined this stream tonight. Uh, you are awesome. Daniel Drummond, hello to you in New Zealand. Oh, both these tractors are going to be finished soon. That's good. We can get on with some more stuff, which is good. Our second day of spring, we might actually get... Oh, no, we need to go and, as I said, we need to go and do something with some lime. So we've got to work out. I think we're going to have to hire a lime spreader. And uh, and maybe get a trailer full of lime. 
Because we've got four fields to do, and I'm not even sure the big lime spreader will do all of that. How's this? This line is fairly straight. We may have to straighten this out a little bit. But in general, that's a fairly straight line. I'm quite happy with that. Just join, so you're welcome. Thank you, uh, Shane. Now you have that song. Well, that's the trouble around here. You will get... I've got a brand new Combine Harvester stuck in your head. Uh, so I have... Uh, I've recorded tomorrow's Marwell Manor video. So that's good. That will be out at midday tomorrow, I should say. Uh, yeah, we need to fix this tractor. We also need to uh, fill it up with fuel. Um, I'm hoping we've got enough fuel to make it to the end of this field with this tractor. Uh, we shall see, though, I think. We shall see. We are, yeah, we are almost out of fuel. I have got my eye on it, and if it drop, if it drops to the next um, indicator, uh, then we will go and fill it up. How's our other tractor doing? Our other tractor seems to be okay at the moment. Hello, DRS66. Welcome along. Hey, Lancy boy. Welcome along. Very much looking forward to your new map, my friend, as well. Uh, the Grower's Diary is first class. Thank you. Um, yeah, I was quite pleased with today's Grower's Diary. Um, I do... Yeah, we are going to have to get it limed between videos, unfortunately. As much as I'd love to have done that on, on, on video, I don't think we've got enough time to do that and get the fields planted. So, uh, we might have the uh, lime spreaders sitting about, though, because those are big. Thank you for subscribing. Daniel Martins, welcome to the BFF. Uh, sorry, 259 watching. That's awesome. Uh... Hello, uh, hello, Daniels, uh, sl Slagter, Slagter, in the Netherlands, welcome along. It's not on Mod Hoster, okay, thank you for that. Uh, thank you for subscribing, Jamie Irwin, welcome to the VFN. There we go. We have almost got this field done. This is, I think this is rain. I think season still has a hiccup in confusing rain with snow. Because it's only ever, I think it's only ever snowed when it said it's raining. And it's only ever rained when it said snow for me. Hello, JKD Gamer. Welcome along. Don't think I've said hello to you. Uh, uh, yeah, it's uh, it'll be a dodgy one then, unfortunately. That might be a um, uh, 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 hack together of uh, mats from 17. There we are. Yours does that when you... I have no geos on here. We're using the standard geo on here. Hello, Ollie Wazzy. Welcome along. Thank uh, Thank you, Shane. I do like this tractor. This is a very nice tractor, this. This is, uh, this is, uh, or actually, this is the tractor that I drove on my dad's farm. I had a 7840 when I was car karting. It is very hard. It's always hard to find a good 7810 in farm sim. Jason McBroom, welcome. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the BFN. Uh, did I get the tool... Where did I get the tool on? This is from mod. Uh, this is from the mod hub. This is the lizard tetra four. It is on the mod hub. Most of my mods are actually available either via the mod hub or via um, yes mods. Those are the two places I tend to look these days. If I'm really desperate for a mod, I'll look somewhere else. But vast, vast majority of the mods that I use in farm sim come from those two places. Welcome back, Connor O'Neill. Uh, Welcome along, Dessa197-77403. Uh, do I know where we're going to get a class window and terror? I don't. A tether. I don't. Uh, there are ones available for PC. Uh, yes, mods. I think it has both a tether and a wind rower for PC. Um, but yeah, not seen uh, any class tethers or wind rowers um, for, uh, for console yet. 
take that up to the line, like so. Yeah, we can uh, go a little bit further. Get that in line with that. I may just um, <coughs> run the bit over here. I think I think we may be able to get the uh, the bit in here, but we'll worry about that probably second gear on here. I think. Uh, when is seasons on console? Uh, my information suggests don't expect it before Christmas. You're getting a steering wheel and pedals for Christmas. Awesome, Connor. Thomas Smith, thank you for becoming a member. You are awesome. Yeah, we will just run uh, a headland across the top here just to clean that up. Uh, just straighten things out. But we've, we've been pretty good, I think, on the headland up here. Right, we're going to start... There we go, around that. Uh, how long have I been on YouTube? Uh, three and a half years at this point. RC Gaming, yes, you missed the song. Right, I'm going to take a uh, headland across here. Like this. Just so that we mark this bit out. Like so, there we are. Gonna go later, item, please. Hope you've enjoyed the stream. Uh, hey, Sandy ATGG, thank you very much. Um, I'm very pleased you enjoyed the videos. Uh, you might be getting the Class DLC tomorrow. Awesome, Andre Wolf. It is a, it's a fantastic DLC. Uh, any cows or sheep coming to this series? No, we are concentrating on pigs and, uh, and chickens on here. Um, I am doing cows and sheep on... Uh, so, the growers, the growers' diary has cows and, uh, and sheep. Um, we have cows... And sheep and horses on um, uh, this is Ireland. Thank you for subscribing. What? Uh, sorry, four three two one. Jess, four three two one. Welcome to the BFM. You're getting the class DLC for Christmas. Awesome. Hello, R uh, RN Agrivins. I'm good. Oh, uh, JKD. <laughs> I'm good. JKD's good, I think, as well. George Senecal, welcome along. When is Greenwich Valley for console? Once Green Bale has done it and uh, and put it in and it's passed. Um, he needs to remove a whole load of branded stuff from the map in order to get it onto console. There we go. You've been spreading manure on your own game with a John Deere M. Cool. Is my map done yet? No. Um... Uh, yeah, I, I I need to scan stuff in. <laughs> the trouble is, so November is an incredibly busy month for me. I am I am doing um, the FSL uh, three out of four weekends in November. Uh, I'm fly. I'm spending most of November flying all over Europe. Um, so there's not going to be too many of these Sunday streams. Um, I'm going to try and see what I can fit in. We may do some some on Monday and things like that. Um, but uh, yeah. Uh, next weekend, I don't think we're going to have a Sunday stream. So, uh, I, I'm going to see where we can fit things in. But, yeah, I'm in Paris next Sunday. So, um, I'm, uh, I'm not going to be able to stream. What I really, what I really want to do is get a good, uh, it's trying to get a good setup and be able to stream from anywhere in the world. If I can do that, uh, when I'm doing FSL stuff next year, uh, I should be able to, to still keep these streams going. But it's, uh, yeah. It's tough. Can I work for Peter Wood? Who is Peter Wood, Owen? Oh, what, on here? I'm guessing that's part of Dagger Wind's, um, survival roleplay. 
Welcome back, lads and boy. Love being able to put a drink next to the window and have a nice cold beverage. Yeah, it is that time of year. Right, so now I want to go up the side here so that we can uh, get this lined up properly. Okay, so multi-terrain angle, definitely a thing on Greenwich Valley. If you look at this, we're, we're driving straight up here and that is, uh, yeah, that is definitely a thing on Greenwich Valley. We are going to go across the top in a minute. No JD Lunker. Not at the moment. Hello, Mark Samurai. Welcome along. Uh, oh, yeah. We are going to be doing something Halloween-y this week on, um, on my second channel. So, if you want to watch uh, me doing a horror game or something like that, Go subscribe to Victor Foxtrot. It's linked to at the top of uh, my channel page. Uh, if one of the moderators wants to put it in the chat as well, uh, they can. Uh, but yeah, I think I uh, might be doing some stuff with Game of Dragon this week. Um, hopefully. Horror related for Halloween. Uh, so if you want to come and, and watch me scream and maybe not be 100% PG, uh, come, and, come and do that. Uh, yeah, come and uh, subscribe to that and we're, we're going to be going and having some fun. Probably on the forest, I think. When is my farm getting realist? Everything's up on your... Excellent, GD. I'm looking forward to that. That's going to be fun. Ah, uh, Peter Wood is on Dagoin's roll. Ah, yes. Definitely watch with a few cans of beer. Thank you for subscribing. FTW Kia Kado. Welcome to the BFN. Uh, can you get PC mods on console? No, you can't. Um, uh, New Holland Man. There's no way to get PC mods on console. Except through Giants unlo uh, uploading mods for console. Right, there we go. This is this field done. And we have enough fuel. We managed to get away with uh, with the fuel level on that. So that's excellent news. And that is our fourth field. So we, the reason why I've um, ploughed all my grass fields uh, is because we have no need for grass. We've got chickens and we've got pigs. So what we need, uh, we actually have to do a mix of... Um, uh, a mix of crops that will do those two animals. There we go. Right, we can turn off the create fields. Yep. And then we're going to park this up here. Like so. And that is out of the way. We might go and wash our tractor after that. Because that is, uh, I think that's this tractor done for today, in fact. Yeah, we need to reset our animal water. So that's good. We'll get that done as well. Where did I put? Oh, yeah, I know where I put it. Uh, have I put a curve on the corner where the house is? Uh, I haven't, no. Uh, I'm going for fairly, uh, oh, I thought I'd put a, do we not have one on here? I thought I'd bought a, um, yeah, there we go. All right, yeah, so our course play tractor, that is almost done. What I want to know is do I have a, no, I don't. We need, uh, we need to put in a pressure washer because I keep getting earfuls from everybody about not having a pressure washer. So, uh, where are we going to put this? I think. somewhere maybe at the corner here would that be good or just inside here oh we could put it just inside here actually yeah right next to our um yeah 
I'm going to put it inside the workshop here. Just inside the door. With the back facing out. Absolutely perfect. Right. So. There we go. Uh, <coughs> Thank you for subscribing. Brady Smith. Welcome to the BFN. Never go much or just move your vehicles outside if it rains. I was, I've been getting a lot of hassle for not having a pressure washer on uh, certainly everything we've done so far. So, uh, yeah, we'll get a pressure washer. Thank you for subscribing. Morgan Edwards, welcome to the BFM. Hello, Tech. Or Tech. Welcome along. Now, there are the lights. Right, that's that done. How are our pigs? Right, we need to go sort this next. So, uh, let's move this. We're going to put these out here. Change my camera angle. Uh, hold that down. There we go. So, that can go there. Pretty out of the way. And then this wants to go on the back here, like so. Right, and our other... Oh, both our tractors need refueling. Need to get street lighting before it gets dark. Yes, we do. So we'll uh, we'll sort that in a moment. Let's uh, hold that. Scroll that down. Put that in there, like that. Perfect. Yes. Brilliant. And they have enough water at the moment. What's the best PC for running FS19? Um, check the minimum requirements. We've got 327 people watching this. You are all awesome. You are all absolutely fantastic. Transformer, thank you for the two pound super chat as well. You are fantastic as well. Wow. Oh, we've got these to use. We've got those to use. Let's go fill this tractor up with fuel. Which we should be able to do from these barrels here, I think. I hope. No. No. Why can we not fill up from these barrels? We may have to fill up a, a fuel trailer or something. What job is next? Right, so we need to work out what job is next. Um, our... We need to do some lime, is the thing. So we need to get some lime and a lime spreader. So what have we got in the shop that can spread lime? Oh, excuse me. And I think we want a fairly small lime spreader for ourselves. So that Amazon there, that can spread lime, holds 3,000 litres. That can spread lime, holds 1,700. That can't, that can't. That can. Oh, but that's part of the Sintrack. Uh, that can spread line. Oh, that coon can spread line. Can take up to 32,000 litres. That would probably be pretty heavy. Byron Waters, thank you for the 1499 super chat. You are awesome. No diesel tank. No, we do have a diesel tank in the yard. And you are right. Why did I just park the tractor up? <laughs> We need to fill that up. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Brucey 16V. Welcome to the BFN. Yeah, we do have. We, we put one in last time. So we'll fill this up. With diesel. There we go. Uh, right. So, uh, yes. We were looking at what we can spread lime with. Uh, and I kind, kind of want to get a fertilizer spreader like that. So, where were, where were I here? So, uh, that doesn't. So, that is 15,000. Uh, holds up to 3,000 litres. Uh, it is 22,000 with the full extension on it. So, that's 22,000 for the Amazon. Uh, the Zax here, 
that uh, is 9,000, but only holds 1,700 litres. Uh, the Breedle here, that holds 4,000 litres, but doesn't hold lime. And the Coon, that holds 3,200 litres uh, with the cover. Oh, wow. And a big working width is... Ah, now this is a good one. Full width with the cover. Uh, transport wheels. Oh, wow. We could, we could fully deck this out and it cost less than the other one. I think this is the one that we want to get. This is absolutely the one we want to get. Try using the little Torion because the trigger may not be close enough. Uh, which one, Thomas Smith? I uh, hope Grows Farm comes out tomorrow. That would be good. What is my favourite tractor? A uh, David Brown 1210. Thank you for subscribing, Jensen77. Uh, welcome to the BFN. Get the coon. Yeah, I think we want to get this fully tricked out like this. 20,000. Um, yeah, we may. I, oh, we can't borrow any money. That's my only worry. If we do this at... Oh, that only takes 10,000 off it. This is the trouble. So, for this, like this, that's 20,000. Holds 32,000 litres. If we take it down to its smallest, that's yeah at seventeen uh, at nineteen thousand. That's still eighteen thousand pound. But this with a cover is ten thousand three hundred. It is literally half the price. Um, and it doesn't hold. It holds less, so we'll have to refill it more often. But it would do. Hey, Chloe, welcome along. Uh, Lloyd Onsworth, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the VFN. So uh, I think I think we're actually going to have to go with this. Even though it's not the best looking of mods. Oh, no hell with it. Let's get the coon. That is 18,000. That literally is. If we're going to go full whack... Let's go full whack. There we go. 20,900. What happens if we take the anti mud cards off? That only takes 200 off it. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to get the coon. We're going to get this. I'm hoping that we can afford the line. Yes. Okay. Right. So, we're going to head down the shop. Thank you for subscribing. Richard O'Brien, welcome to the VFN. We might have to take this down the shop. Um, and this as well. I think we need... Should have some pallet forks looking at this. And I think this will pull our trailer as well. Yeah, there's our pallet forks. Now we do have one full thing of eggs. Thank you for subscribing. Alfie Simulator Gaming. Welcome to the BFM. Right, there we are. So we got those. Other thing we need. Yeah, I won't forget the street lights before it gets dark. It's still 11.30 in the morning though, so we're good. Right, and our other tractor has reached the trigger, trigger point, so that's good. Where is there a lime? Where's our nearest lime? Because uh, we don't have one here. Is there anywhere that does lime? What's that? That's it's Whitney. No. No, that's cell points. We look after a white one, I think. Yeah. Okay, so there are literally no lime um, places. So we are going to have to buy lime. Now, how much is lime? <laughs> That's the next thing. Uh, so, for 460 for... T oh, wow. We can buy lots of lime. 700 for 2400. Uh, yeah, we will be buying those, but we need to get this down to the shop. Okay. So that is what we're going to be doing now. And this does hook up to this. Doesn't have anywhere for our 
That does not connect up to those. So hopefully this will work. Yeah, that's working. Good. Lime is in the shed. Lime is in the shed? Oh, lime is in the shed. Yeah, we do have some lime. So we have... Uh, 400 litres. We don't have a lot of lime, though. And that's seeds. Right. 2,000. Yeah, we've only got 2,400, so we do need some more lime. We're not going to have enough lime. Yeah, lots of people shouting at me. Lime in the shed! Lime in the shed! Uh, but yeah, we don't have enough lime. I want at least two more pallets, I think. Uh, oh, and we need to go and just stop our other tractor. Because that needs refueling as well. Hello, James Toms. Welcome along. Yeah, everybody's shouting at me, lime in the shed. Right. Uh, this needs filling up and washing. So we'll do that quickly before we go as well. And we can leave this filling up while we uh, while we head off. <sighs> Have I got any animals? Uh, yes, we've got both pigs and chickens. How are we feed on the feed wise for pigs? We're good for the feed feed wise for pigs. Uh, do I know anything about Seasons Xbox? Yes, I do. Uh, Seasons for Xbox will likely be out by Christmas, Ashley. Um, uh, according to um, my sources. And I should say my sources are speaking to giants. Uh, sorry, uh, let me rephrase that. I wouldn't, the exact words were, I wouldn't expect seasons before Christmas. So if it appears before, it appears before. If it doesn't, then um, yeah. BGA sells live. Well, I, I think if we get pallets, if we get pallets of lime, that's probably the best way to go. Right, that's our 8340 all cleaned up, uh, along with our back bit. Let's jump into these. Uh, so this needs to be, that is on follow me. Good. Let's get these up the driveway so that we can get the 8340 filling. There we go. I think I'm going to put a back driveway out of the farm. Oh, I forgot the class. That does not react well to follow me, that that little thing. Uh, is this map coming out on console? Yes, eventually. Yeah, I completely forgot that we can't do that. Right. Oop. Refill that with diesel. So, take the follow me off this. And we're going to have to put the follow me on the other tractor. So, we'll squeeze past. There we go. Just put the follow me the other way around. Is Greenwich Valley coming on Xbox? Yes, it is. On the plus side, we get to drive this little thing, which is an uh, amazing little piece of kit. Oh, is that going to be a crash? Yes. Both for me into the hedge and the tractor as it's coming out. <laughs> Play on Xbox. Uh, do you know if steering wheels work on Xbox? Uh, yes, the G920 works on Xbox. What is my big tractor? Is the 8340. Uh, where can you get a wheel knob like this? This came from Amazon. There is a John Deere wheel knob on there. I think, in fact, I have it maybe linked in the description. Where do you get the mud that fills water? That is PC only. It is the uh, Enhanced Animals mod, I think. Is Grow's Farm coming to PS4? Uh, I believe so. Uh, I believe it will come when it passes for PC as well. Uh, it's been submitted for PC and console at the same time. Can I make tractors follow you on console? No, that is a PC-only scripting mod. Uh, how's my day going? My day's going better. We've got over 300 people in here again, which is amazing. Have I uploaded those video files yet? No, I haven't, though. And I apologise for that. Um, yeah, I need to... Oh, God. I, I've had a... 
The reason why, part of the reason why I wasn't able to test my internet connection before I started this evening was because my children wouldn't go to bed. <laughs> so that's why I was late. Uh. Uh, when is season's coming to Xbox? I wouldn't expect it before Christmas. 213 likes, 315 watching. Uh, let's hit that. Uh, let's hit that like button, guys. See if we can get that up a bit. See if we can get that over 300. That would be awesome. Don't blame the kids. No, absolutely not. Hello, Rory D Duken. Uh, welcome, Duken. Welcome along. Right, turn down here. Yeah, if we put a, a, a rear entrance to the farming, we could do it down the side of field 79 and uh, and come out down here. Uh, yes, I am. It's and it's uh, it, it's yeah. The, it's the router. The router is a little bit dodgy. Considering I had to pay for the router is not great. Green dot at the bottom right hand corner is, is it on PS4? Uh, down the bottom right hand corner. Um, oh what the uh, no, that's the enhanced vehicle mod again. It's a scripting mod. 231 likes. Do I like the Seasons mod? Yes, I love Seasons. Uh, does SciTech panel just plug and play with FS19? Yes, it does, because it was built for it. Um, why doesn't the console get the passenger seat mod? Um, that, Sam, um, is because uh, it's a scripting mod. And uh, in general, there are exceptions, like Seasons. Um, but in general, scripting nods don't make it to console. Hello, Trevor Ula. Welcome along. I hope you enjoy the stream. Hello, Lucas Agri 66 7. Uh, well, uh, I hope you're having a good evening. I'll sit, Walters. No problem at all. Uh, Jeffrey Gibbons, do I farm in real life? Um, I uh, used to. Um, my dad sold his farm about 15 years ago now. Um, so I haven't in the last 15 years. Uh, do I like football? No, I'm more of a rugby fan. Um, I was, uh, I've been shouting at the TV for the last two days. Uh, <laughs> on, uh, on Saturday because England made it through and on Sunday because Wales didn't. Um, uh, what's a scripted mod again? A scripted mod is anything that adds extra functionality to the game. So... Uh, scripting mod, an example, would be Follow Me or Seasons or things like that. Um, do I like cricket? Yes, I do, Crazy Ewok. I, in fact, I play cricket whenever I can. Trip and Morgan, thank you for the subscribe. Welcome to the BFN. Seems like I'm enjoying the fast speeds. Yeah, a little bit. This is uh, this uh, the driving this to the shop actually lets me read the chat. Uh, who watched England versus New Zealand yesterday? I did. I was screaming at the TV because that was a fantastic rugby match. Um, who do I think is going to win, England or South Africa? It's a tough one. I remember watching the England-South Africa final in uh, 2005, I think it was. Uh, which was amazing. Wow. This does not like pulling this trailer up this hill. England will win easy. Oh, well, we will see. I think it will. Plus, depends on the features of the one you have. Get more stable routes. Yeah, no, there is that. And, and yeah, I'm not quite sure where to go with it, Arthur. I probably will have a word with you about it sometime. Because, yeah, I paid stupid for that router. Um, Jerry McBurney, thank you for the follow. Uh, thank you for subscribing, sorry. Welcome to the VFN. Oh, come on, up the hill. Should put the trailer on the Ford. Yeah, except we're, we're going to be using this trailer with this uh, on the way back. So I wanted to make sure it could actually pull it. Uh, it can, and it is, so that's good news. Uh, do I think Follow Me will come to consoles in the future? Um, unlikely, but possible. Paid less than, yeah, I did pay less than Rod was paid for his router. That is very true. Um, really bad at pronouncing. I'm sorry, Stephen. I will just, <laughs> I try and pronounce people's names. At least I try. That's the thing. Admiral Aspen, welcome along. Forgot the horses on the trailer. Yeah. Um, 
half faggery 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 uh thank you for subscribing welcome to the bfn uh golo 13 farmer welcome to the bfn thank you for subscribing uh, do I know if Ford is coming to console? Highly unlikely, as uh, Giants don't have the uh, license for Ford. Um, however, there is one Ford tractor on console. I don't expect that to be repeated, though. Uh, that surprised the heck out of me. Uh, downhill all the way home. Yes, exactly. So we should be all right. Right, there is our spreader. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take this off, follow me. We're going to go and hook up our spreader. Uh, and then we're going to fill it with lime. And hopefully then we've got enough seeds. Um, e Barnett uh, 3 thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the BFN. Hello, Jamie Laffey. Welcome along. Long time no see, indeed. Right, so let's lift that up. Oh, actually, we'll leave that down. Now we got 3,200 we can fit into this. So we'll take that off and we'll go and buy ourselves some lime. Now, standard lime pallets, those are 450 for 2,000. Yep. Yeah. And these pallets are 460 for 2,100. I think that is better deal. Uh, that's 700 for 2,400. That is expensive. So we want, uh, yeah, we want these line pallets here. So we need, uh, I think we need seven of these because one of these we're immediately going to put into our thing. So we should have enough money to do seven of these. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six seven there we go uh when is this map coming to console i don't know um when it's done basically right, pull this forwards and then we can easily load this up right uh, disconnect that let's load up first so fill this with lime i love using these bags i think these are great mods these bags why am I yelling? Because I'm getting excited. And because I'm not used to having a good mic. <laughs> That's why. Oh, those wheels are awesome. Look at them rolling. I like that. I like that a lot. Right. There we go. Uh, do I like Dagoin Survival Roleplay? I don't get to watch Dagoin Survival Roleplay enough, to be honest. Um, but what I've seen, I like. What I've seen has impressed me. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Now, that is a little bit rear heavy, but all good. Wow, we do have, I know we don't quite have the biggest. Let's go put the biggest weight on this and at least level this out a little bit. Customize biggest weight. There we go. Don't think there's any other changes. No, that's all good. Customize. Yes. There we are. And hook that back up. Oh, and yep. Yeah, and that on and that on. Start the engine. Lift it up. Uh, New Holland in the mod hub. Yeah, there's there's a New Holland on the mod hub. You can put um, uh, Ford details on. But there, I doubt we're going to see a straight up Ford like this. Uh, on the mod hub. That is a impressive looking tractor. In fact, that right there is an awesome screenshot of this. There we go. No need to load these up. We are. Oh no, we're good for that. 298 watching now. And we are going to load up this line. So, yeah, we should be able to fit six pallets on this trailer. I'm hoping. Yep. 
Yeah, that'll fit. Now, can is this long enough? Yeah, this should be long enough to get it on the far side as well. Absolutely brilliant. Whoop. Like so. Hamish Key, thank you for the two pound super chat. You are awesome. And yo to you as well. Um, New Holland 72 by Smetty is what's called the board on console. Yeah. Uh, do I have it in here? I might have it on here actually. Uh, is that it? That might be it. Nope, that's not it. Might be the other one then. Is it this one? New Holland. Fiat. I know those colours. Uh, design. No. Wheel setup. No. Nope. It's not that one either. Maybe it's the really big one then. Which I might not have enabled on here. Which I don't have enabled on here. Because we weren't planning to use any big tractors. So yeah, I don't have it here. Hey, Hamish. Welcome along. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, it has been a little while. Uh, who got the F? Um, a very nice guy called... Oh, I can't remember. I did I did post it everywhere. It's on my... Uh, it's on the uh, community page. But yes, he's received it and he was very thankful. And, uh, and yeah, he's... Uh, he was an Australian, if I remember correctly. Hello, Luminous Project. Welcome along. Oh, uh, yep, that can go on a little bit. There we are. So let's strap those down. What wheel do I use? AG29. Uh, well, it's, uh, need to go and run some errands. It's Sunday. See you later. Um, yes. Yeah. I don't know if you saw in today's video, uh, SFTN, I did put uh, a little allusion to something happening, maybe. So, uh, yeah. Absolutely. Pedals. Uh, pedals are the same as... Oh, they come with the wheel. Ah, uh, the twins. Don't they are doing well? Thank you. They were being a bit naughty tonight. As I said earlier, it delayed me getting ready a little bit. Um... And then, uh, and then, yeah, everything kind of went a little bit wrong as well. So, uh, <laughs> but I'm less stressed now because we're having a good stream. Now, now that things are moving, okay, that is not good. That is not a good piece of stacking, BF. That is an absolutely awful piece of stacking. Yeah, I'm going to have to get this from the other side. Otherwise, I'm not going to get all six on. Which is going to be interesting. Kids are never not normal. Well, that's true. Uh, do I wear shoes for my pedals? At the moment, I'm wearing slippers, to be honest. Uh, but yes. Yeah, I, I don't tend to use my pedals in my socks. If that's what you're asking. I find it's uh, much more difficult to control them. I have sung I've Got a Brand New Combine Harvester. That has been sung. There we go. Evening, Granddad Farming. Hope you're doing well. Not too late. We're, go we're going a little bit longer simply because I started a little bit later. Uh, hopefully, we're going to get some lime spread tonight if we can get this back to the farm. There we go. Uh, do I have a tractor in real life? I do. I have a little LT um, lawn tractor. I have a little lawn tractor that I was actually out this afternoon cutting my lawn with. There we go. Right, we'll strap those down as well. Oh, no. We'll just do the one strap for now because we'll want that last strap for the last two as well. Evening. 
evening, Dodd 2020. Welcome along. The trick with these, uh, with these, uh, these front loaders. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, I need to come straight onto that. Uh, is to uh, is to not turn them stationary, but try and use the whole thing to position where you want them to be. So, in this case, I want that to position there, and I can keep it fairly straight if I slowly undo that. Hey, Fiat Gaming, a vehicle inspection, I think. <laughs> uh, do I... Uh, I know of the Funky Farmer. I've never watched any of the Funky Farmer's stuff, to be honest. But, yeah, I do know of the Funky Farmer. Get this on the back. Is that on? Almost. Out. Right, one more. Uh, what do I think of the new DLC? I love the new DLC. It's fantastic. I've not tried bail stacking with this piece of kit yet. Um, but we will do at some point because we need to do some bales on here. So, uh, yeah, we are going to have to do some bail stacking with this. I discovered with the cows that you get... I always thought with seasons that if you use straw, you get no, um, uh, you get no slurry. Uh, but I've got cows on uh, at least one map now that are producing both slurry and straw. So uh, yeah, you've been gilding all day, in knackered. Oh wow! Well, nice restful stream for you, Hamish. Uh, what's my favourite farming simulator? Uh, FS19. FS19 is absolutely awesome. Uh, it has just built on uh, the previous versions on Farm Sim brilliantly. Right, let's get this back to our farm. And what we can do is we can set uh, our 7840 here. We can set that doing lime while we uh, get... Um, while well, we unload this lot. So... Away we go. Oh, wow. We've got a fairly steep hill coming out of here. Uh, what day is the map VF playing coming out? We don't know when this map is coming out yet. Um, it needs to be tested. Uh, well, this version of Greenwich is out. What steering knob am I using? This is a John Deere steering knob. It's official John Deere steering knob that is on Amazon is where I got it. Um, you do need to replace these. So the bolts that go through here are too short that come with it to go on this wheel. I had to get some longer ones. Oh, car. Can you go past, sir? You, uh, you just have FS17. FS17 is awesome. I mean, I loved 17. You just got the class DLC? Awesome, Ollie. You, yeah, I, I don't... Un that's amazing, GD, because that is as long as I've been producing videos. <laughs> maybe maybe the channel just... Yeah. But that's, that's longer than I found your channel. What's my favourite version of SimCity? SimCity 2000. Uh, what about other SimCity type games? Um, actually, I haven't played many other. I need to play... Um, oh, I forget what the sort of the spiritual one uh, that's connected to it is. Forgot to connect the hoses. No, the, the hoses don't connect on this. That's, that's why this is going at 14 miles an hour. Otherwise, the brakes would be stuck on. Correct answer. There we go. Yeah, no. SimCity 2000 is the best version of SimCity. Bar none. Um, I haven't played a version of SimCity since SimCity 4, though. 
Oh, I'm a little bugged up. Go past Linton Mill, maybe a shorter route. Um, is that it? I didn't think it did. Uh, yeah, we could go south. We'll try going south. So, round this way. If you're in the UK, go watch the... Okay, the crazy walk. I will check that out. Um, but yeah, in general, no politics in here. Especially Brexit. Brexit gets me on a whole thing you don't want to hear. Um, do I prefer class Jaguar on wheels or on tracks? In general, I prefer stuff in uh, farming on wheels rather than tracks. Uh, the one that's just called SimCity was... Yeah, SimCity is fantastic. Um, uh, the original was brilliant. But the original is also... Wow, the original is nearly 30 years old. Uh, yeah, please don't promote your own channels. Uh, if I like your channel or I just like you in some cases, uh, I will, uh, I will uh, promote the hell out of your channel. Uh, what steering wheel am I using? A G29 uh, with added um, uh, steering knob on it. I don't know if this is much quicker. I mean, this tractor, this this front loader is not a fast piece of kit. So, do I have a multiplayer server? I do, big man, Jim. It currently has FSL on it. I need to um, I need to work out what we're going to do with the multiplayer server. Um, so I might, I might sort of ask the, because it only has, uh, the only people who have access to it are patrons and channel members, uh, Twitch subscribers and, um, uh, and, um, ugh. there's one other and I forget it. Um, but yes, so there's, uh, there's that. It's, it, so I need to check with those guys. What do they want out of the multiplayer server? Fan participation videos? Uh, I do do fan participation streams from time to time. What do you miss while you're gone? Uh, we've loaded up lime. We're heading back to the farm. We're hopefully going to get some fields limed today. Would love to do a multiplayer with me. Ah, oh, thank you, Sam. I always said the easiest... So there's two ways... Oh, yeah, community members. There's two ways to uh, get onto that stuff for free. Uh, one is reach level 8 in my Discord. You can do that by uh, chatting on there fairly easily. Uh, the other way is if you have Twitch uh, and uh, and uh, Amazon Prime, uh, you can uh, become a Twitch Prime subscriber on my channel uh, over on Twitch. That's many times I've said Twitch. And, um, and yeah, that way you can also get access. Um, next multiplayer should be on Friday. Not decided what it's going to be yet. Because we, we might do an FSL. We might do something else. I've not got the Xbox yet, so it won't be an Xbox one. Right, let's start with this field, shall we? Now, 18 metres, I'm not expecting to have to do much. Uh, course generation, we want to end here. Uh, so field 78, current vehicle position, starting direction, automatic, uh, longest edge, uh, bypass islands deactivated, 18 meters, headlands, yes, one, yes, uh, we want to go counterclockwise, uh, we want to do headland passes last, headland corners, turn, and generate. Yep, not much to this, this should do this fairly quickly. Uh, why am I playing by myself? Because I enjoy playing Farm Sim by myself. And chatting to you guys. Do a Greenwich Valley stream uh, as you're away in Paris next. Yeah, I could do. I We could do Realism Experiment on Friday. And I'm very tempted to do that, actually. Oh, it's up the other end. So, yeah, we might do a Greenwich Valley stream on Friday. Um, does mean that we'd be here on YouTube rather than on Twitch. But we'll see how we go. Uh, Paris should be fun. It's uh, So I'm doing the Farming Simulator League for those of you who uh, aren't aware of my uh, extracurricular activities for Giant Software. 
If we multiply it together soon. There we go. And this tractor should be more than powerful enough to do this job. First waypoint. Drive course. There we go. So that is off with the lime. Yeah, I've been to Paris before, so this isn't my the first time I've uh, I've been on a trip to Paris. We're gonna put the lime in there. Uh, do I put the lime in there or in the shed? I think we might do storage for all of our stuff in there. Or oh, we need to clean that up. And we do have a bucket. That's good. Yeah. I think what we'll do is we'll put. I think if. Going forward, we're going to use this area here for storage for this kind of stuff uh, rather than in the shed. Uh, we might even move the stuff we've got in the shed out. Um, but I think we're going to re we're going to refill the other stuff with lime. For, uh, the bleh. We're going to use the older lime that we've got first to do that. To refill our stuff. But yeah, we also need to clean the pigs out. And probably, yeah, um, oh, wow, okay. There is no food in our chickens, so that is our next job after we've unloaded this line, is we need to get that going. We should have, I think we've got some, uh, we've got some chicken food, I think. I think we've also got some pig food. There we go. Uh, are we happy for Shamrock coming to FS19? Yes, it means the return of Eddie, which I'm very excited about. So what is uh, what is this in here? Is this chicken food or is this pig food? That's chicken food. Perfect. Just need to make sure we don't pick up lime in our bucket when we go to get the uh, chicken food. There we go. No, no, back. Thank you. So I'm going to stack these uh, here. Hope Sony passes PS4. Yes, that would be good. Wow, really? And this is why we bought so much lime. Look at that. That is a pallet and a half of lime that that has spread in that time. Uh, do I get sore eyes on the computer? No, I spend a ridiculous amount of time on the computer. So I'm used to it. Um, I did go get my eyes tested recently and it wasn't too bad. Uh, which Cobble Park Farm? Yeah, you're not the only one. Cobble Park Farm is my all-time favourite farming simulator map. And, uh, and yeah, I miss it. But I understand Bullet Bill's reasoning and why he doesn't uh, why he doesn't like it. So, uh, yeah. Right, let's go fill up. Open that up. And those two. Is Greenwich Valley out for console? Not yet, Dara. Right, there we go, and then we need to fill up from uh, the one that we've got half empty already. So that is around the far side of our trailer. Yeah, there we go. That's filling up from the right one. There we go. So we'll fill this up before we do the next field because, yeah, <laughs> there's no point in starting the next field without filling up. Those were the good old days, yeah. We had a lot of fun doing this uh, this series on Cobra Park Farm. How much did my setup cost? Um, I think the last time I worked it out, um, my setup was about 2,000, 2,500 all in. 
Five course. There we go. So that is doing the lime again. Hello, Jake Wolf. Evening, Rockstar player. Oh, that doesn't take into account the laptop that I'm going to start using as the um, the game machine. So yeah. What's wrong with Cobra Pop Farm? Uh, nothing's wrong with Cobra Pop Farm. Um, Bullet Bill just uh, isn't a fan of FS19, so isn't making Cobra Pop Farm for FS19. So, uh, yeah, you won't see Cobra Pop Farm on FS19. But you will see Sandy Bay, which I'm very excited about. Right, so I'm going to stack these. Uh, because we do have so many. Sandy Bay is not out. Uh, Farmman101, if you see Sandy Bay uh, a downloadable for FS19, it is an unauthorized conversion. Do not download it. Um, it is broken and it is, uh, yeah, and it is not how Oxy intends it. So, uh, yeah. And it's on lots of, if you see any site, I'll put, I'll put it this way. If you see any site listing Sandy Bay for download, don't use that mod site. <laughs> that is a surefire example of a dodgy mod site. Ah, cool, Jake Wolf. Why does a bullet bill? Um, they're just various bits and pieces he doesn't like about it. I'm, I'm I don't want to go into it too detail because I don't want to put words in his mouth. But I know, I know, BB is just not a fan of FS19, so uh, for various reasons. Thank you, Tom Reed. Thank you very much. Uh, let's... Oh, no, 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 no. Why can't I get this straight? Why am I not... There we go. Whew. Glad I got that before I pushed that off the end. Let's stack this. So, there we go. That's another set of lime. The work tool needs to be refilled again. Hope he, uh, yeah, I hope he comes back for FS21. Um, we'll see uh, We'll see how it goes. Because uh, everything will be refined for FS21. That didn't even make it all the way around this field. Wow. We might need more lime. We may not have enough lime to complete this. Because we get it for, for three loads? That is not a lot of distance we've gone for three loads. Go straight to the class and get in a John Deere. It's Old Valley Farm. I don't know, to be honest. It's beginning to rain, so we're not going to be able to uh, do anything more. We'll finish this off. Um... Because it ground won't be too wet by that point. But yeah, we're not allowed to do lime in the rain otherwise. So we're going to go and fill off um, bits that we've got on the trailer. 
But that does not bode well. We are going to have to go and buy more lime, by the looks of things. After limey the field, uh, what we're going to do, we are going to uh, feed our chickens. But as I said, we can finish this off before it gets too wet. So that's 72% full. Uh, as we've only got a very little of left of the field to do, we'll go and do that. What I what I really like about this farm here and where this farm really plays well to the realism experiment is everything is clustered around the main farm. We can very quickly and very easily get about with stuff, uh, which I love, which is absolutely brilliant. Right, so... Around the corner here. And drive course. Yep, that is off again. Street lighting, yes, and we need to do the street lighting. There we go. So, we're not going to get the rest of that field line today. But what we'll be able to do is continue liming next time. Yeah, we've got nothing left on the train. Wow, we have got through a lot of lime doing one field. That is a little bit concerning. Right, this needs to go in. We're down to 7,000 in the bank. Our other tractor has finished, so that's good news. Uh, we will park this piece of kit up. Now. Uh, and we can go and do... Our, uh, our chickens next. Got the class LC, but don't work well with the round bale and upper... Yeah, I'd, there's, I've heard I've heard a few minor issues with the uh, round baler. Um, I need to do some testing on it because I've heard that in seasons it instantly creates silage bales. Which, of course, is not right. Right, we need to get this tractor back as well. So we can't do any more lime in the rain. Uh, as per the realism experiment rules. So we'll get this back. Uh, we'll clear that course off. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need seeds. I think we may have to take on a contract. And why can I not drop my front loader off? Oh, maybe because I'm not going to set. I'm not going to set. There we go. Right, let's sort out our chickens. When will the stream end? Uh, about uh, at the moment, we're looking at about quarter past ten ish. I think we've been going for an hour and forty-four minutes, so we've got at least fifteen minutes to go. Pigs have plenty of feed. There we go. Do I like any football team in so much as uh, supporting football? I um, I'm an Orange City fan. Um, I don't follow religiously or anything like that. There we go. So we'll clean up our chickens. Now one thing uh, this rain will do is this will fill up. 
Wow, that gave them next to no feed. Uh, it will fill up the water troughs uh, for our um, for our pigs, which is good news. But what we need to do now is get the feed. So we'll fill this up. You like Rangers FC? Ah, cool. There we go. So yeah, we we are a little bit shorter on money than I would like to be, to be honest. Uh, we do have some eggs. Uh, we may have to sell some pigs. There we go. Now, how long does that do our chickens for? Be repeating that question. It's the pig yard. Oh, yeah, it's the pig yard on this map. Sorry. Uh, yeah, it's the pig yard on here. So that's a good amount of food, and we've cleaned them. That's excellent. Uh, that is... Yeah, they're low on corn, but they're okay for other stuff at the moment. Uh, cleanliness, we just sorted. And water, we could... We'll let the rain fill up their water trough for a bit. Uh, but that's good for the pigs. Uh, we need to put this back next. Ah, Bye, Alex Shearer. Catch you later. No, that's not close enough. Turn that round. There we go, jump out. Connect that up. Right. Oh, I, I actually, this is one of the reasons why I love these articulated vehicles for reversing a dolly like this, because you can just guide the dolly so much easier. It's a bit like uh, connecting. It's, it's a bit like the reason for connecting a dolly up to the front of a tractor because it's just that little bit more manoeuvrable to get it where you want it to go, like so. Ta-da! Right, that's parked up. Uh, and what I'm going to do at this point is we're going to check over our pigs. Uh, we're going to check the forecast for the next couple of days. And basically do some uh, stuff around the farm to try and work this out. So, turn that off. And then while we're in the dry, uh, let's, oh, actually, let's go and have a look at our pigs. How much are our pigs worth? So we've got some uh, we've got some piglets, so those are all good. Um, what have we got older? Uh, yeah, we need some. Wow. Most of our pigs are all oh, right. Okay, so we have Yorkshires. Um, did I see a thousand? No, I didn't see a thousand pound one then. If there was any that was worth that much, that'd be good. Uh, that is good price. Another breed, but very fast growing animal, but requires a high amount of capital for initial purchase. So we've got some good ones here for, for sort of 396. 441 at 423 pound. Oh, sorry, 243 pound. We were looking to get them up to, to 400 pounds. So, uh, yeah, we've got a fair amount of work to do, I think. Um, I think they're, they're that weight when they are... Um, uh, when they're pregnant. So I, I'm still unsure on to how to do these. As it wouldn't be much use. For, <laughs> no. Uh, is the load of 64k? I think it is. So yeah. Just lots of rain. If the rain stops. Then we'll be able to spread some more lime. But while it's raining. We cannot spread the lime. So let's have a look. at. Uh, we can plan our crop rotations now as well. Uh, which I think we did last time. So, 
We've got rain for basically the rest of today going into next time. Uh, so on Wednesday, we should have a clear day. So that will be good. Uh, and we can work on that. Uh, what else have we got? We are crop rotations. We haven't worked out yet. So we do need to pop out in the rain. We need to work out our fields. So this one here, this has been fallow and fallow. So that's good news. Uh, we need to, yeah, the other three are around here. Plowing is the most therapy, uh, that and, uh, bale wrapping. So this is fallow and fallow, so that's, actually, that's really good. Two sets of fallow before we do anything. This is fallow and fallow, and then here. Oh, wow. Wow. This was potatoes, so that has all sorted itself. That's quite good. Go through the pigs. There we go. Like so. Back in the barn. Back in the dry. Uh, and yeah, so we're pretty we're pretty good in so far as what we can do crop rotation wise, because everything is is fallow followed by fallow. So we can pretty much, at this point, wheat, barley, oats, cotton, canola, sunflowers, everything will do really well in this soil. So we want some wheat. We've got four fields, so we're going to do a different rotation in each field. Uh, we want... Uh, right, what do our pigs eat, actually? No. Nope. So our pigs need... And we may need to get a new header for some of this. Uh, corn, wheat and barley, uh, soybeans, canola, sunflowers. So we're going to need a corn header for that. So we might as well do corn, wheat, canola and sunflowers. I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, so let's plan that into our rotation. So corn, uh, canola. Uh, sorry, wheat, canola sunflowers and corn now we need corn more than anything else uh, but all of those will do well so that's good i i think we may also need oh we're gonna need another cedar because i bet this cedar doesn't do everything so yeah that is that is going to be annoying because we're gonna have to get another cedar you like the pool hey dusty dave welcome along but there's literally there's really not much we can do in this rain we can't sow, plough or cultivate, but there are contracts for it. Wow, sowing potatoes at this time of year. We've cleaned up our pigs. We're in a bit of a bind because this is what the realism experiment does to us sometimes. It really does just send us to the point where there's nothing we can do. Ah, yes, there is stuff we can do. We need to do some lighting, which has been mentioned to me a few times. So, where's the lighting on here? We've got the Christmas tree for later in the year. Uh, miscellaneous. Here we go. It's a 1,000 for the lighting or 800 for the street lamps. Oh, wow. We can go for just a normal street light as well. Which is, uh, yeah, which matches the ones we've got. So, I think... We probably want... This is the trouble. I'm not sure we should. We're coming out of spring. We, I think... For when it's dark... We are actually fairly well suited at the moment. It's not perfect, but it, it, it'll it do us. Can't believe it's Monday tomorrow. Yeah, there is that. Uh, Aaron. Uh, ain't reading chat. I am reading chat. Crop rotations down, not across. Yes, I know. So, yeah, crop rotation is down, not across. So, we've got fallow, fallow, wheat, fallow, fallow, canola, fallow, fallow, sunflowers, and fallow, fallow, corn. So, it's down like that. Can't plant. 
Yeah, it's yes, Shane. But yeah, that's the. So if you look in the description, we have rules for the realism experiment, and planting in the rain is one of them uh, that we can't do. So yeah, so there is that. Selling time. Uh, where's the best time to sell pigs? I. Th do you know what? I think we're going to have to sell some pigs. I need to, you know what, we're going to jump, I need to know more about these pigs. So we're going to head, we're going to make use of our time, good use of our time. We're going to head down to, thank you for the super chat, George Munro Jones, you are awesome. Uh, we are going to head, yes, rotation one, two, three, and four are yearly. So uh, we've got fallow on the previous two and then we're planning for this year's crops. I need to know where the animal animal dealer is straight down the bottom. So let's go do that. Uh, KJMFS question. Uh, you need to install the spray rate mod for the mod to have allows you to control the rate which the spray and spray fertilizer lime. Yes, I do. And... Uh, can you put that on Discord? Because I need reminding of that. I've been meaning to uh, download it for a while. Great, is good. You can start from scratch and the shed stay there. Yes. Um, I like The maps I like are the ones where you have a mix. So you start from scratch with some sheds and not others. Um, which Greenwich also does, to be honest. Tablet crashed. Oh, dear. When do I think the Land Rover will come to console? Uh, never, unfortunately. Uh, might make an umbrella. Might make me an umbrella mod. That would be awesome, Kevin. Keep the rain off. Uh, that's Linton Mill. We want the next turning. So why am I going down to the animal yard without the ability to purchase animals? Because you get when you come to here and try to buy stuff. You normally get more information. Which, unfortunately not. So I think I need to research the cows a bit, uh, the pigs a bit more. You normally get a good time to sell the pigs. Um, what weight to sell them at. And that's the thing. We get, if we're getting up to like 429 at six months... That might be a good time to sell them. But I'm not 100% certain. So that is that is the thing. Uh, when I get the Land Rover from, that was uh, sent to me by a modder or given to me by a modder. I'm not sure if he's releasing it or not, to be honest. Uh, yes, I am very much looking forward to Dusty Dave's map. A big man, Jim. Thank you for the £2 super chat. You are awesome. Uh, hello, JP4. Welcome along. Uh, so we do have a few that are worth like 380. And we have five. Actually, we need we need to sell some pigs. Right, we are going to sell pigs. That's what we're going to do today. We need to make some space. We have lots of pigs that are worth at least half as much as we originally paid for our pigs. So, uh, yeah, I think we're going to go and sell some pigs. Make some space in our pig yard. So that we can have lots of more little piglets. Do I like the Greenwich map? Yes, I do. So let's go do that to finish off tonight. We've still got some time. It is half past whoa, four in the afternoon. Where can you find my setup? Uh, my setup is listed in my description. Should be listed in my description, I think. Uh, with Amazon links for most of it. Do I have crop rotation? Yes, I am trying to use the crop rotation. Yeah, Bessie Beneath, I am looking forward to that map massively, uh, Dusty. Because I love, Dusty Dave, I love your maps. Your maps are gorgeous. <laughs> right, let's park this up. We can get the 8340 because that's not attached to anything for this. Uh, and this will probably be the last thing we do today. The 8340 is not busy. Well, none of our tractors, strictly speaking, are busy. This is an amazingly detailed map. And I, I'm really enjoying this. And I'm enjoying playing a different area to most people. 
Because this is the thing that I tend to do on maps these days is not play the main farm. There are very few maps where I'm uh, where I'm playing the main farm. Um, Lone Oak is an example of somewhere where I'm playing the main farm. Because right? Lone Oak's main farm is awesome. So we're going to sell some of our more expensive pigs, I think. We've got some that have reached sort of six months old that are a good price. Um, the fact we're up to 500 pigs is, is yeah, really quite telling. So I think we can afford to sell a few. Right, so let's see. I think I saw... We've seen one for 400. So 315, 364. There we go. 412. So we'll sell that one. 412. We'll sell that one. 429. 429. So they do go up bigger. So we're basically trying to fill this animal transport with the pigs that will sell for the best price. And the thing is, we didn't buy 400 of these pigs. We've had a lot of piglets born quite nicely. Oh, wow. We've got a lot of 400 pound pigs. There we go. Livestock trailer is full. So confirm that. Thank you, Rockstar Player, for the two pound super chat. You are awesome. I love Dusty Cove. Dusty Cove is a fantastic map. So we should be able to sell quite a few pigs here today. We've got more pigs worth £400 than I realised. So that is uh, that is actually quite fantastic. Hey, we're out. Welcome along. What's the best map to Let's Play on? Uh, any of the maps I'm currently playing on are all brilliant. So, uh, this is Ireland, uh, Oakfield Farm, uh, Greenwich Valley, um, I'm going to forget one in a minute, um, <laughs> Growers Farm, I'm loving, uh, which is an upcoming map from MJ, um, uh, Shamrock Valley is awesome, uh, so that hopefully should be out soon, um, Lone Oak Farm is brilliant, it kind of depends on what gameplay style you want to play, um, there are so many. Um, oh, Marwell Manor. Marwell Manor, I'm having a blast on at the moment. And all I did was start with New Farmer, sell off all the equipment, and and then start, you know, filling up again with new equipment and, and using the class DLC to do it. Am I friends with Dagoin? I am acquainted with Dagoin. I wouldn't say I'm friends. He and I don't talk that much. In fact, he and I haven't talked in a few months, to be honest. Not since we tried to do a series together and discovered that we, we don't really record at the same time. And that then made it a bit impossible. Like Marwell. Yeah, Marwell is, uh, is awesome. And I'm... I'm I record, I've recorded tomorrow's video. Um, I've got to finish it rendering after this stream. Um, but it is just... Yeah, it just is a brilliant map. And I missed its brilliance a bit the first time I played it. Which is why I'm so pleased I'm going back to it this season. Right, here we go. So, we are going to sell these. These One of these is up to £455. That's brilliant. 5,102, that is just the kind of boost we need selling these pigs. Um, and the thing is, that it all it does is it, it just makes space for us. You restart a Marwell, and Marwell has been so well received. I'm so pleased with how that series has gone. So, uh, yeah, I, I think we're going to be on there for a little while. Um, I think we're going to start... Um, uh, winding down this is island now rockstar player thank you for the two pound super chat you are awesome what is the best map uh you think is worth it Oof. it's tough I, I am loving this is island this is island is a brilliant map i'm loving this map because this map is a brilliant map i am i'm loving Sham shamrock valley is an awesome map 
it, as I said, it really, really depends on how you're looking to play. If you're looking to do start from scratch, this map is brilliant. Because the fields are small, um, the farms are in, excuse me, inexpensive. Yeah. Uh, am I friends with DJ Goham? Yes. I would say that DJ is a friend of mine. In fact, no. Yeah, DJ is a friend of mine because he and I are friends on Facebook. So, uh, yeah, DJ is a friend of mine. He is an awesome guy. And I love DJ to bits. If you guys are not... I know he's not in here. If you guys are not subscribed to DJ Goham, check him out. Awesome American uh, streamer and YouTuber. He can't stream much at the moment, but his videos are fantastic. Um, he's up there. He and Silver News absolutely have... Um, so much news content uh, every day uh, that, that both of them are well worth uh, checking out uh, for, for the latest Farmson news. Uh, so, yeah. But, yeah, DJ and I have uh, sort of have been um, becoming friends ever since uh, we sort of discovered each other's channels. And, uh, and yeah, he's an awesome guy. Really awesome guy. And doing so well. 276 likes. Can we get to 300 likes before the end of this stream? There we go. Open that up. Right. And open that. Right. We're looking for any pig. Over 400 to start with. Because we still have so many pigs. Because we need to make some space. 300 likes for a slipper. You can see my slippers at 300 likes. If you're really that desperate to see my slippers. Uh, was that 400 I saw? Nope. Nope. They are going up in price though. 355, 390. There we go. A 412. Another 412. A 429. We've got a few that are coming up to 400. I think 400 is a good point for us to sell pigs at. Oh, I haven't played the music since I sang. There we go. Uh, how many days per season? Six. There's a couple of 4.11s. And a 4.55. Thank you, Rockstar Player, for the two super star, uh, uh, for the two pound super chat. You are awesome. Nice Land Rover Defender. Thank you very much. Do I have any news on Greenwich coming to console? Not beyond what Green Bale has already released. Uh, hello, Jack Jones. Welcome along. Uh, bye, Sam Travis. Hope you've enjoyed the stream. Hello, Rowdy Dan. Welcome along. Yeah, we have a lot of pigs that are coming to a good price as well. Uh, lots of 390s in here, uh, which is brilliant. We might... I think we're probably just going to sell the 400 today. Good to know that we should be able to make a steady amount of money off the pigs. Uh, and it's really sort of the first time we've done that. And I think that's it. So we might throw a couple of 390s in here. I don't know how full our transporter is at the moment. But yeah, so 10,000 a day off the pigs. That would be great. So I'm looking for a couple of 390s off here. Hey, Miss K, thank you for the one pound super chat. You're awesome. Would I like David Brown slippers? That would be pretty awesome. Uh, right, we're looking for a couple of 390s. There's a 390. There's a 390. There's a 390. There's a 381. I'd rather not sell. Wow, that's a lot of 381s. 396 livestock trailer is full. Confirm. Thank you for subscribing, uh, Parish. Welcome to the BFN. Uh, keeping me busy. Uh, I think he would. Uh, Kevin. Would I like. Yeah, I would like David Brown slippers. Uh, later, uh, Seek and Destroy. Thanks for joining us. Hope you've enjoyed the stream. 
Hello, Parkona784. Uh, Welcome along. Uh, do I? Th what do I think of the class DLC? I love the class DLC. One of the best DLCs ever created for Farm Sim. I only left because the singing tone. <laughs> Hello, Alex Malone. Uh, one day you'll give me a thousand pounds. That would be very nice, Reagan. Um, as I, I, I would be very grateful, and uh, and we'll see what happens. As always, the proof is in the pudding. And I'm sorry if I sound a little bit um, wary of that. It's just that, yeah. I will happily say thank you at that point. Yard tour when I go back. Okay, blurred upload. Yeah, because we have nothing else to sell today. I don't want to sell any more pigs. Selling a couple of 390s is okay, but I don't want to sell too many. Goodbye, Jack Jones. Thanks for joining us. Thank you, Jordan Donahue. Uh, which map would I recommend to a new player? That's a tough question. Um, I would actually... Do you know what? No. To a new player, I would recommend the default maps. Go play the default maps in Farm Sim before you try any mod maps. Because mod maps always have their own little eccentricities and things like that. Go try Felsbrunn or... Um, uh, Felsbrunn or Ravenport for your first maps. Absolutely. Get your feel for how the game works and then go and play on a mod map. There we go. Your 13, no job and break. Yeah, that would... <laughs> right, there we go. Let's sell these. I can't believe we've got a 455 in here. Uh, thank you, Rockstar Player. You are killing it with the Super Chat tonight for the £10 Super Chat. Have I watched Ollie's Farm? Uh, I think I have watched Ollie's Farm, actually. Hey, and uh, uh, Brigger, welcome along. I hope I've pronounced that right. There we go. Close that up. So that's another 5,000. So we're up to 17,000. So we're basically back where we were. Oh, we're not. We actually, we're not too bad off. That's good news. Uh, Trevor Nichols, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the BFN. Too many emotes. Yes, don't hit too many emotes. You will get bopped by Nightbot. Uh, so we will keep an eye on our pigs now. And, uh, and, and yeah, sort of weed them down a bit. Make sure we have a good amount of money coming in every day. Um, I don't think we've got anything leased at the moment, so that is good. Oh, no, we do. We have the header trailer leased. Um, but the thing that costs us the most money every day is our loan, uh, which is quite big. Uh, if you keep till... till I'll give it to... Hopefully... Uh, how come I'm still live? Uh, I am just finishing off. It is 25 past 10. I do need to finish off. Uh, we're going to have a tour of the yard quickly. And then I think we're going to finish. Uh, we've sold uh, the pigs that we're going to sell for today. Uh, uh, all of our animals are good. Otherwise, um, I think we're going to have to. When this dries off, I think we're going to have to do a contract or two. Uh, try and get a bit more money in. We might do that potato planting contract. Um, because that would work very well for us, I think. Uh, the clocks did go back, yes. Uh, do I watch Dagwin from time to time? Uh, have I got a few? Uh, yes, I have. I can pop into... Um, I can pop into the chat offer. Yes. Am I putting any likes up? I'm not going to, Paul, simply because, A, we're coming out of spring. And as you can see, we're finishing the stream. We've been going in uh, 2 hours and 14 minutes. And we're still good likewise. So until next winter, we're not going to really have to worry about it. Uh, so at the moment, with the lack of money we've got, uh, I think it wouldn't be wise. I think we're better off just um, holding off on that. We are just going to park this up. Yeah, our pigs do have some food, so that's good. We may have to buy some pig food, because I don't think we're going to get through to the point. 
Uh, we're also going to probably have to take our combine up to the um, up to the shop to go and pick up another header at some point. Uh, but we've got we need to get another cedar first. There we go. Let's go park this up like so. There we are. Um, and yeah, yard tour. So, uh, these are our two tractors. We've got an 8340 uh, Power Star SLE and a 7840. Uh, we've got a Class Dominator Combine. So, this is the um, pre-order bonus one uh, from the Class DLC. We've got the Class uh, 639 Torion as our a little front loader that we use. Uh, and we've got the bucket on at the moment. Uh, we've got a couple of piles of seeds. We don't have a lot of seeds here. So we are going to have to... We have to keep selling pigs because we're going to have to buy seeds. Uh, we've got our Amazon uh, cedar here. So that's our little cedar. Uh, we'll close this door while we're here. Oh, no. Let's get out of it first. Um, then over here we've got some pallets for eggs. So we're filling up these egg pallets. We've got a full pallet there. We're waiting to sell... Um, we've got chicken food, we've got lime, uh, we've got some barrels of fuel, uh, we've got our front loader, uh, we've got our uh, pressure washer. Uh, this is our farm trailer, it's a Marshall in blue, uh, the header for our combine. Uh, the Flegel Arnold trailer you've just seen me using and then the Flegel flat, flat bed that we use. Ooh. Hey, Silver News. Welcome along. How you doing, my friend? Uh, we've then got our Dodi. Um, this is our subsoiler. Uh, this is our plow, the Terra 4. Uh, and then we've got a mega, uh, a hardy mega sprayer as well. Um, oh, yeah. On the back of one of the tractors you saw the spreader we were using earlier. Uh, we've got an Eye for Williams trailer here. You can see this is looking a bit mucky and old now. Um, and then we got the landy, and that is basically our farm. Uh, <laughs> yeah, not much more. Uh, we've got a couple of. Um, uh, so we've got our pigs here that you've seen. Uh, we're just going to fill their water up so we don't lose any pigs overnight. Thank you, Rockstar Player, for the one pound super chat. You are awesome. You have, yeah, you have given so much tonight. Thank you very, very much. Uh, so we've got another set of eggs on the way. And these are our chickens, which we've got 500 of, I think. Yeah, 500 chickens on here as well. So, yeah. Uh, not yet, Taylor. Uh, that is... Uh, we're still we're, I'm still working on getting the stuff together for Lancey for that. So that is where we're going to end tonight's stream. We have... Uh, we've done a lot, actually. I'm really pleased with where we've got to. Uh, next time, uh, we'll be back here on Wednesday. Or oh, let's, uh, let's pop out to it. So we'll, uh, we'll save the game. Like so. Uh, we will, um, F. Oop. Yep, we'll pause that. Uh, we'll pop out to here. And, uh, and yeah, so I'm pleased with that. That is, uh, we made a lot of progress. We will be back here on Wednesday night. Um, we, uh, we will continue the realism experiment then. So hopefully you guys can join me, uh, at that point. Um, I've got a few thank yous to say quickly, um, because yeah, you guys have been as awesome as always. So, uh, a huge thank you to Rockstar Player for your one, two, three, four, five, uh, for your five super chats. Uh, you are amazing. Thank you very, very much. Uh, Treffin, uh, no, um, who else have we got in here? Hamish K, thank you for your super chat. Um, George Munro Jones, thank you for your super chat as well. Uh, in fact, Hamish, thank you for both your super chats. Uh, I thought I had another one. No, that's it. So uh, that's all good. Um, unfortunately, the credits aren't working on the end of my streams on YouTube at the moment. I don't know what's happened. Streamlabs has mucked up. So apologies for that. Um, but thank you to everybody who subscribed and uh, and those who went over to Twitch and followed. Uh, we'll be back on Twitch on Tuesday night doing more from Lone Oak Farm. 
Um, not sure what we're going to do on Friday. We might be back doing the realism experiment again. Uh, we'll see how we go. Uh, but, oh yes, and go and subscribe to Victor Foxtrot, my other YouTube channel. We are going to be doing uh, something Halloween-wise on Thursday night. So please come and join uh, both me and Gamer Dragon and probably some other people. Uh, probably doing the forest on on. on Thursday night but that won't be quite so PG as I normally am so uh, yeah head over there and uh, and do that um, you guys are awesome as always we will be on Marwell Manor tomorrow this is a huge information jump um, <laughs> so uh, yeah so come uh, watch tomorrow's video at midday um, I've got a couple of super chats that are coming up so Transformer thank you very much for the two pound super chat uh, you are awesome also Rockstar player, thank you for another super chat. Uh, you are also awesome. Uh, I have uh, pretty much finished my ramble, which means that all that remains is for me to say thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this live stream. Please give it a like, drop us a comment, and give it a share. And for all the latest videos and live streams from Virtual Farmer, please subscribe to the channel and ring that bell. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.